this evening with Nathan Feiler. Uh, before we uh, we are going to delve into your book, The Shah of the Fall, mm -hmm. um, uh, tell me a bit about this movie because there's a quirky, quirky story behind it. It's wonderful. Is that, oh gosh, I sound very loud. <laughs> Hello. I sound loud it's, to it's me. Just your voice. It's okay. No problem. Okay. So I'm really nervous, so but I'll settle into it. Um, and hello, and thank you for, thank you for coming. Um, yeah, I just love that film so much. I think it's really beautiful. We don't, I mean, obviously I can't read a word of it. Is it words from the, from the novel? I'm, <laughs> it's a joke, sorry. <laughs> I, know, <laughs> I, I know the words. Um, I, I met Udo, in, I, I met the, the, the animator who's here, so Udo Prinson, who made it, is, is here. Um, we met in... Uh, I didn't tell you where I live yet. It probably doesn't matter, but now I'll tell you because then you can have some pictures in your mind as you read. Reading is a bit like hallucinating. Hallucinate this. An ash grey sky over a block of council flats painted jaundice yellow. I'll buzz you up. It's the sixth floor, number 607. Come in. The narrow, dim-lit hall is cluttered with pairs of old trainers, empty Coke and Dr Pepper bottles, takeaway menus and free newspapers. To your left is the kitchen. Sorry about the mess. I know when I was writing the novel, I was working uh, in a research role at Bristol University uh, in an office uh, with a, a wall behind me <laughs> and no, no one to the side of me. So, um, so I got quite a bit done at work. <laughs> <laughs> Um, uh, and I, um, uh, so I was a terrible researcher. I, um, I worked three days a week and I wrote for, for two days a week at home and I treated it like a job. And um, yeah, there's lots of kind of, you hear different writers with their kind of, their writing process and people who will say, I've got to get a chapter done by the end of the week or I'll write 500 words a day or a thousand words a And I didn't give myself any of those rules, the only rule that I get, because I think if you say you've got to write 500 words, then you might not and you've failed and you feel bad. The only rule I gave myself was you will sit in front of this computer for eight hours today and, and you'll do that tomorrow and, and then next week you'll do that on two days next week. And, and so, yeah, and incrementally it came. 